Good morning everybody. We are here at Strawberry Reservoir. We are gonna fish for some trout today. I wanna change it up a bit. This is actually how I grew up. I grew up fishing at Strawberry for trout. So just going out for a day just to take some time and relax and hopefully we catch some fish. Stay tuned. All right guys, so we're starting out with the Lucky Craft Pointer 78. I really like the action it's got to it. I think it's a good search bait. We'll throw that out there. Second bait of choice is this uh, purple woolly bugger. It's been a staple of mine since I started doing this a couple years ago. Picked it up from my uncle. It's done really well. Always seems to catch very consistently so one little BB weight on it and away she goes we just need a few 18 inches today that's all we want a couple 18 inches like four of them <laughs> there we go and we're trolling pull out there right there fish on oh no he came off shoot because I'm so awkward with my stinking left hand <laughs> that's too bad well keep going fish on Come here, little guy. Oh boy. Oh, not little guy. Good size guy. Oh, come here. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Well, that's one of the ones we're looking for. And a half. All right, buddy. Thanks. Appreciate your help. See you later. Oh, stinky thing. You know, I forget how much more slime these trout have oh, than the bass. Okay. What we're doing is working, so let's not try and change it. Here's a trick. Uh, this woolly bugger will get hit a lot, but I have a hard time keeping the fish on the hook. So, I don't know if you can see, I will uh, put a trailer treble hook on there. This is a Gamagatsu uh, treble hook right there. Um, and that sticks them every time. Anyway, thought I would share that little trick with you. All right, so here, I'm getting a lot of hits on this uh, Lucky Craft lure right here but on the uh the larger size so i'm taking the exact same color the exact same presentation i am just make uh, doing a smaller size lure because i feel like it's gonna help increase my frequency of bites by giving them something a little smaller something a little less intimidating so they can uh, come up and get it without any qualms about it. It's coming out the boat. There we go, another cutthroat. Uh, ooh, another big cutthroat. That was that second hook that got him. 
came up for it, and that second hook of hook took it. Come on, baby. Get back over here. Come on. Yeah. It's a big one. Those purple woolly buggers knocking them dead. I'm thinking about taking the other pole out just because it's a hassle. Oh man. Man, these fish are, these fish are slimy. Okay, see ya, buddy. See ya, bud. There you go, all righty. Adjusting again back to the big one here because the little one didn't get any bites. And the big one has actually caught fish today. So there must be something about this larger size that they like. And I was mistaken in thinking that they would be less intimidated by the little one. That's totally fine. But on the other hand, this purple woolly bugger, putting that trailer on there has been key. I have caught uh, all but one of my fish today on this and it's been because of this trailer treble hook that gnat, that catches onto them and then it gets deeper in their mouth and I really set the hook and this big one really gets caught in there so that little one really helps hold, helps hold on to the fish for a second gives that big one a chance to really set the hook on it so that has been a really really good idea for for this trip Got one on. There we go. Man. If you don't reel these guys in quick, they come right off. Can't keep that tension on them because they come right at the boat. They just get turned and come right at the boat. Long and skinny. Okay. There you go, bud. See ya. Can we not go on that side of the boat? Ah, 
Dang it. Come on. Oh. Just when I thought this would catch any more, it caught one other one. Ooh, it came right off. Oh. I don't really think this one's gonna help us, but we're gonna take a picture of him anyway, just in case. There we go, another one. Got him on that back hook. Again, now. There we go. Oh boy, man, they don't get hooked very well. That's for sure. Just be a big fat 18 inch rainbow, dude. Come on, buddy. Be a big one. I need, I need the big ones. Oh, whoa. I don't think this guy's gonna cut it. Dang it. I just pray to Lord with all my heart. Amen. Thank you. 